Uh, yeah. Uh, so, uh, the Earth is a pretty exceptional place. Uh, there's nowhere quite like it. It's irreplaceable. Uh, animals and ecosystems work as like a perfect cohesive system. Everything plays its part with like a perfect balance. Uh, even the smallest change can like domino effect and exponentially like affect and change seemingly like the relevant areas of the ecosystem. Uh, global warming is one of the most pressing issues facing like our current planet. Humans burning fossil fuels, deforestation, uh, industrial processes are like kind of like the main things I think. Uh, but the consequences are crazy. Um, they're very far-reaching, like rising sea levels, increased frequency and severity of natural disasters, very high loss of biodiversity. Melting polar ice caps, causing sea levels to rise and threaten to displace millions of people in low-lying coastal areas. Increasing temperatures can also lead to crazy weather patterns, meaning more frequent and intense heat waves and storms and wildfires. Humans are inherently dangerous towards nature, even if it's not purposeful. By stealing natural ecosystems for development, we're forcing animals out of their homes. We invade their territory and destroy their way of life. Uh, feeding wild animals like chipmunks teaches them to come for humans for food instead of finding it for themselves. Chipmunks, when searching for food in the forest and in the brush, are natural pollinators and taking them out of their environment eliminates their power to pollinate. Creating unhealthy eating patterns makes them unable to find food on their own and survive, cutting off a predator's food supply. This isn't something that's going to change on its own, at least while we're here. Okay, um, with the rapid popularity of urbanization, our world's future isn't looking very bright. Steel jungles and towering skyscrapers are closing off and pushing away many opportunities for beautiful plains and forests to grow, along with all of their inhabitants. While these large cities are rising, crime rates, violence, and social unrest are becoming more and more apparent, along with the higher cost of living. Unfortunately, Many people who are working in the construction industry are une uneducated or unaware of the future effects their work will have on their environment and their society. Okay. As someone involved in the construction world, how does your work affect the environment and its inhabitants? Well, I think when I first started out in construction, um, we didn't really think too much about that because we were just building things. And so we were primarily concerned with uh, the inhabitants of the house that would be built because uh, I primarily do uh, residential construction. So we didn't think too much about that kind of stuff. Um, and so we just would find some land and we would um, dig a hole, pour some concrete in it and throw a house up. Um, but now I think one of the uh, big pushes in construction is lead construction or green building or sustainable building um, where um, we're a lot more concerned about how um, our building does affect the environment and all of the animals and uh, yeah so it, it's moving to a place where um, construction is much more concerned with how it affects the environment much more so than it used to be uh, second question 
have companies or workplaces you've worked with done anything to educate you on the possible negative effects of your work? Mm, outside of accidents on a job site, um, not particularly. Yeah. Yeah.